In the Miltronics API thread chasing macro. Um, it's very simple, easy to use. Basically, you're going to start your program. And stay modal up there. It's my same program, so I'll start. Hit cycle start. And now it's going to ask me a series of questions. First, it wants to know the Z start point. I'm going to start 100 thou off the, off the Z. You hit enter to get to your next step. Your Z end point, I'm going minus 3.3 inches. Next, it needs the angle. This particular API thread is a 5 degree. The lead, 0.25. Needs the depth per pass, and that's going to be on the diameter, and I'm doing 5 thou per side. Number of passes, I selected 2. Retract distance is 0.5. That's to clear the part. Chamfer length. I left that zero, and the chamfer angle I left zero. Asked me for an RPM, 150 RPM. I chose one for clockwise, a zero for no coolant, one if you want coolant. So it takes all that information, compiles it, and then it throws me into the hand mode. So I'll select my remote hand off. You want to move my threading tool into any particular thread. Okay, once I have it eyeballed in, uh, you hit enter to continue. Now it's going to ask you to start your program. The first thing it's going to do is orient the spindle. Oh, I'm sorry, it, that did it already. And now it's going to start the spindle and begin counting and come up and catch that thread.